Let's get buzzing. We are buzzing. So, Craig, why are you looking at me like that? Okay, so, Colin Powell, um, which is what? His mother called him. <laughs> People call him Colin, but his mother Colin. always call him Colin. It's Colin, man. The Yardy thing. So, um, yeah, it's a Jamaican thing. He's a retired four-star general, and he became America's first black secretary of state and chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. But he died on Monday due to complications from COVID-19. This is what his family said in a statement on Facebook. Yes, yeah, so Powell, who's 84, was fully vaccinated from COVID-19, his family said, and had been treated at Walter Reed National Medical Center, but was suffering from serious underlying, underlying conditions. Uh, they said, and I quote, we have lost a remarkable and loving husband, father, grandfather, and a great American, the family said. Okay, so Powell and his wife, Alma, were tested for COVID last Monday and both tested positive. Uh, Powell was then hospitalized and at Walter Reed Hospital. Powell had multiple myeloma, a uh, cancer of a type of white blood cell, which, which can harm the body's immune system. Sir, he also had surgery for prostate cancer when he was Secretary of the State, and more recently, Parkinson's disease. Uh, the four-star general served as the 65th United States Secretary of State from 2001 to 2005. He was the first African-American Secretary of State and very proud of his Jamaican roots. Mm. Big up. Big up. <laughs> yes, yeah, we, I, yeah, I, we, lost a, we lost a great one. I remember, I remember when he was appointed, I was like, whoa. A yard in the White House or what Yes, else? and he represented us so well. Yeah. You know, I, I love that. It was weird when, 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 when he was introduced as Colin, though. I was like, Colin? Colin. These oh, Americans, I'm joking. Yeah, a Colin. Colin! <laughs> yeah, a, a Colin. Colin! I know but, a few Collins. I don't know no Collins, though. Just saying. I, I haven't met one yet. But um, okay, okay. Mm, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Um, he did a fantastic job serving and representing us. Um, I remember seeing his photograph and being very like, oh, you know, when you see his pictures around and you just at a time that you see a lot of other, you know, white persons being represented in certain mm -hmm. things. And it was always a pang of pride for me to yeah. see him. I always thought he was really close to white though, but, but he wasn't. That's the point. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's yeah. all it's all very yeah. close a lot of the times, yeah. but it was still like we respected. Yeah, it's still, it and still feel like one away. He represented us. Because yeah, sometimes people that are and I'm close, but they're yeah. like, Jamaica, yeah. what is that? Yeah. Where you know, but the fact that he was very much like ba yeah, ba ba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, he didn't say that ever, by the way, but <laughs> it felt no, well, that way. Well, to, to, to be this, <laughs> nobody says that. To just be the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, I'm going, but, 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 it's a dangerous. I'm just saying, it <laughs> could have other implications. You can't, them man just a bop. Yeah. You get bop. You get bop. You, you get bop. But I mean, it's interesting to know that, that, that uh, both of them were fully vaccinated, though, and they still, he still succumbed to it. I, I didn't want to go there, but whilst we're here, I think it's really interesting um, and, uh, that the, the, the cause of death is, is um, being. Mm -hmm said what they're saying. You mm. know, the fact that he died of COVID-19 complications. I'm like, this young man had various um, illnesses that he was, he was battling with. I think it's interesting. You know, they say once you're in a hospital and once whatever, whether you broke your leg or you die, you, you know. So I, I would like that narrative to be... It shows how serious the disease is and you, you have to take it very seriously and you have to be careful. That's basically it. Mm. Yeah. All right, so the law enforcement authorities have confirmed that three people have been killed in the Pathways International Kingdom restoration of Montgomery Church in St. James. Now, the Norwood Avenue building is said to be the home of a cult where a ritual was being performed. Uh, one man was shot in the head by the police when, res when they responded to calls for help. Mm. It is reported... Ooh, it was reported mm. that two other people had knife wounds. Now, photos show men partially nude, covered in blooded sheets. A woman dressed in white who was laying in blood appeared dead. In the meantime, the police have detained almost 40 people who were meeting at the Norwood Avenue building in Paradise. Now, a policewoman who was among congregants is among those who are being detained. Well, the congregants were all dressed in white and they were taken away in a Jamaica Defence Force truck. The head of the St. James Police Division, SSP Vernon Ellis, said the police recovered a pistol and several rounds of ammunition from the scene. Uh, the Independent Commission of Investigation is probing the matter as we speak. So a woman who <laughs> was spotted leaving the building had one hand raised to the heavens and the other clutching a toddler. Neighbors recounted that around 7 p.m. they heard heavy gunfire 
and then screams of the members. I don't know about you, I yesterday I was home and uh, my service provider was not being very nice to me. So I was without service yeah. for whatever. And somebody called me and was like, have you heard what has been happening? And I was like, what are you talking about? He's like, this is going off. And I was, I was my heart jumped, jumped into my mouth. Um, it's such, we're in such serious times. Everyone is under such pressure right now. Um, it's so sad as well. It's unfortunate. All these words that we could say, you know, all these describing words. But um, yeah, what's your thoughts, Craig? Yeah, I mean, so there are, there are, there are I've heard a lot of things about um, the happening surrounding this cult. I've, I've, I've seen a few of the videos and it's very disturbing. However, I mean, I hear, I hear people also saying that um, they, 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 they can't understand how, how we reach here. But what I want people to understand and pay attention to is that these things don't happen overnight. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a gradual erosion of your, your, your belief systems and your, and your values and your, 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 your self-value. Because if you value yourself, if you value your own life, you will value others and the lives of others as well. So that's really, that's really what it is. I mean, it, it is it's a thing that happens over time. It, it's, it's, it's not surprising to me. It's disturbing, but it's not surprising. I think that you hit the nail on the head when you said how difficult these times are and how trying these times are now. Because when we're going through tribulations like this and hardships like this, people tend to, to get tired and, 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 and deflated and they need to look to people for some kind of spiritual guidance. They need to look to things that are bigger than themselves in order to cope. Mm, look external so, rather ex than looking internal. Exa exactly. So you, we, what, I would, what I would ask everybody is to please pay attention to the people that you put your trust in, the people that you choose to, 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 to follow, to allow to lead you because okay. it's still your decision whether they lead you or not. You know? But, uh, and I, you have to be very I, I love that you said that. I also want to add something that in these times, it seems like a lot of us are not using or it's like we're not in a sense. People, we are able to, even in this dispensation, make choices for ourselves. Choices that are good for you and your family. So you can't just be okay to let somebody just lead you off the mountain. But remember, like all of us have to own... Like anybody, even my daughter, I'll ask her opinion, and, and it's my house, you know, my daughter living in my house, just so I'm, I'm clear, my house. And even then, I said, this is what I believe. And she has a right and a, a, a expectation to say, mommy, that's what you believe, I disagree. Yeah. Respectfully, I'm not saying she costs, but say, I disagree with that, mommy. I don't think. But you can't and, cost you well, well, she has to, <laughs> she have, she have, she have to cost with, with uh, harsh tone. But um, yeah, I think we also need to think for ourselves. Now is the season to think for yourself. Do not be led down any alley that you didn't want to go down but in and, the first and, place. And also, don't, don't be too harsh though. Because remember that people don't really jump off cliffs unless they believe that what is at the bottom of the cliff is better than where they're coming from. Yeah. So it's, it, it, what, what is happening is that everybody's um, patience and, 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 and spirituality and belief is worn so thin mm. that them, them grasping at them grasping Let me tell you something. Straws. I was in church. I have a degree in theology, very much right. in church, speaking in tongues, believing, believing. You guys don't know this about me. And my pastor said to me that um, performing arts was off the devil and I need to step away from it. That's the only way I paid my, my poor little daughter, put food. I had to say, hmm, I can't, su I can't support that. But some of them are the biggest gifts, actor. Anyway, I'm not gonna go into that because we have another really, really awesome um, story. We're not talking yeah. to Craig. So, so <laughs> yes, go Craig, go ahead, go ahead. All right, so many Jamaicans <laughs> at home were gearing up towards the Versus event with Supercat on Saturday night via Instagram, but Later in the day, it was stated that they would have to pay $2.99 US to watch the concert, which featured the Dan Dada himself. Also featured Wyclef Jean and his refugee sound, the General Barrington Levy, Baby Shop, Conscience, Young God, Dexter, Taps, TJ, and much more. So, Craig, Craig, have a lot of thoughts on this. I'm going to throw it out to Craig first. Do yeah. you think that the promoters, Swiss Beats and Timberland, should have made it clear from the announcement way back in the day, because we knew about this a while ago, we spoke about it, mm -hmm. that it was a pay-per-view, or is it that Jamaicans at home just don't like pay-to-view their own culture? To them. To them. Jamaicans don't like pay for nothing, whether their own culture or not. However, they are more willing to pay 
for foreign things. And, and that, is a, that is a problem. However, I mean, I think $2.99 is very low considering mm. the artists that were on it. Mm. I mean, I, I would appear that Watch Dexter Dabs alone. It's true, because they have less some. Um... Super Cat and Wycliffe yeah. and Barrington Lee. Hey, you ever watch Barrington Lee be perform? <laughs> Barrington Levy are generally. Craig is off, guys. Come <laughs> on, he's a living legend. I That's agree, I agree. People must recognize that. But man. I do want to say, though, I 100% agree, or, or they were going at it early today, or producer and Craig were really, like, butting heads about it. Just so you know, um, I want to say, I do think that if they were, if it was a pay-per-view event, it should have been made clear True. sooner, personally. True. Like, they should True. have made that decision that, yo, this is, so that's poor planning for me. So Craig was saying that perhaps something, some problem arose and they needed to change the dimensions of whatever. For me, that's poor planning on your part and too bad for you, promoter. Because it is what it is. Sometimes you have to take, you have to take leak, you just have to take where you get sometimes. Yeah, so well, that's if you can't take the leak. You, you, you see, well, we, we assume well, Timbaland pocket and we assume Swiss Beats pocket, right? No, we assume Apple pocket and we assume... Uh, so, so that's we, who we, pocket we, we assume. We, no, but... Apple. Yeah. Yeah, but sponsorship is if you if you ever put if you ever put on a show, you know, so sponsorship is sponsorship. And when sponsorship money done, it done. So if your platform cannot support the expected Spotify. traffic, Spotify, and you need to get more, you I'm need joking. to pay for it. I'm you joking. have to charge for pay for it. Yeah, that's how it goes. And guess what? On that note. On that note, <laughs> that we love to say, I love to say this. I'm gonna be right back with. The letter of the day, not the offer of the you day. You know, to sing it though. No, that is offer no, of the day. No, but my offer is high, you'll be letter of the day. Madonna. Yeah. Anyway, letter Who of the follows? day.